In this video, we'll take a look at the Lewis structure and molecular geometry for SBF5 2 minus. So the first thing we'll do is we'll count the valence electrons up so we can draw the Lewis structure. SB, that's in group 15, sometimes called 5A, five valence electrons. Fluorine is in group 17, sometimes called 7A. It has seven, we have five fluorine atoms. And then that negative two, that two minus up here, that means we have two additional electrons, two additional valence electrons. Add all this up, we get 42 total valence electrons for the SBF5 2 minus Lewis structure. We'll put the least electronegative element in the center, that's the SB, and then we'll put fluorine atoms around the outside, five of them. We'll put a pair of electrons between atoms to form the chemical bonds, and then we'll go around each fluorine and complete its octet. So at this point, we've used 40 valence electrons, but we have 42. Each fluorine, that has an octet. Those are good. The central SB, it has 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. It has more than an octet. That's okay. It can have an expanded octet. So we're going to put the last two valence electrons on this central SB. Put them right here, and let's make them a different color so they're easier to see. So this is the Lewis structure for SB F5 2 minus. Let's make these bonds here, these electrons shared between atoms, let's make those lines. That'll help as well. We also need to put brackets around this since it's an ion. Then we'll put that 2 minus out here. So this is our Lewis structure for SBF5 2 minus. Let's take a look at the molecular geometry. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 atoms and the one lone pair here. So this is the central SB. We're going to add 5 chlorine atoms. 1, 2, 3. You can see them spreading out here. 4 and 5 but we still need to add that last lone pair. That occupies space. When we add that, it kind of forces these things down. It gives us what we call a square pyramidal molecular geometry. The bond angles here are 90 degrees. If you look at the electron geometry, you need to take into account the lone pair on the top, so you would end up with an octahedral electron geometry. Let's go back to our Lewis structure. You could also use the AXE notation to figure out the molecular geometry. A is the central atom, that's SB. X, that's the number of atoms bonded. We have the five fluorine atoms. E would be the lone pairs. We only have the one lone pair here. So that would be E1. You'd look that up. You'd find out that it's square pyramidal, just like we found before. This is Dr. B with the Lewis structure and molecular geometry for SB F5 2 minus. Thanks for watching.